Hello YouTube, Kira Kage here with another mod installation guide request from Killer Evil. Let's have a look at what the mod is. So we'll go ahead and go on to that. Cross card lightsabers. Oh, okay. So with these mods you can't really have another lightsaber mod in there at the same time. Just a heads up. So because uh, they usually say that down in the um, area, yeah, incompatibility, see? Uh, with up crystals and stuff. So uh, just a little wee warning there. So we'll go ahead and download it. So I'll pause it while I do. The download is done. So I'll just go ahead and go into it. Open just once. I should have an always. There's a readme PDF. I have had bad luck with PDFs. So just go into the override folder, copy everything in here, go through, check everything out, make sure, just check see what's there. Alrighty then, and then this was for KOTOR, right? Uh, yes. Also, uh, request to people who request for me to do this stuff, uh, I request that you please specify which game, because KOTOR and KOTOR 2 are two different games. So, um... Yeah, just please do that. Uh, so, KOTOR files, so just go ahead and pop it into here and go OK, and that's done. And then you have the option of go back to where I was, there we go. And then you can, so that brings up a specific type of blades, that's what I was reading here. So, if you want to have the default blade textures or the animated, you just go ahead. So, you say you want the default blades, you just copy all of this. And then you pop it into your override file in here. That was the wrong one. It was supposed to be KOTOR 2, but you, you get the idea. Uh, and then if you wanted the animator blades, you copy that and then move that to your KOTOR override file. And then just pop it on in there. Just go replace all. Should be good to go. And yeah, if you enjoy leave a like if you're new please subscribe if you have anything to say leave a comment down below and i'll see you in the next video bye for now